Good morning, friends. Today, the case that we are discussing is a unique case, a very rare finding that we see, you know, but it is relatively common in the endemic areas, but it is rare for other countries. So today, the sign that I'll be discussing you is something which I saw in the morning. Now, I want you to take a careful look at this CT coronal image of the chest. We are viewing the image in lung window. We are viewing the image in lung window. And can you see a focal lesion which is surrounded by a crescent of air? When, as soon as I saw this image, the first thing that came into my mind was aspergilloma. We all know that the crescent appearance is classical of aspergilloma. So as soon as I saw the image, I thought aspergilloma. But then I was about to sign the report and I saw, why am I seeing another layer here? Now let us look at the axial images. Let us look at the axial images. And one layer, air, and air below the second layer as well. Okay, look at another axial image. And when I saw the abdominal scan of the same patient, I could see a large cystic lesion in the right lobe and smaller cystic lesion in the left lobe as well. Now, what do you think is the diagnosis? Crescent appearance in the lung lesion and a cystic lesion in the liver and we are looking at an Indian patient. What do you think? As soon as we look at such a combination, immediately it comes to my mind that we might be looking at a patient of hydrated cyst. Please remember that even hydrated cyst, what happens is the outermost layer in the hydrated cyst is called as pericyst, which is the host reactions. What happens sometimes, the ectocyst of the parasite erodes the bronchus present in the pericyst and you may see air tracking below between the pericyst and the exocyst. This leads to a crescent appearance. Sometimes you may see air tracking tracking below the ectocyst as well like you see in this case where we are able to see two layers like an onion skin like appearance this has been called as the combo sign so interesting case that we saw today was hepatic hydrated cyst as well as a pulmonary hydrated with combo sign which is air tracking below the ectocyst in the hydrated cyst where we are able to see onion peel like appearance in hydrated thank you very much take home message here is that never ever think that aspergilloma is the only cause of air crescent sign. There are other causes as well. In an endemic area, think of hydrated cyst as well. Thank you.